Okay, use simple interest. So we've got a few things going on. Use simple interest to find the ending balance. All right, so in order to find interest, there's this formula. Interest equals, so principal is the amount you are investing or saving times the rate, that's the interest rate that you change to a decimal, times the number of years you invest. So interest, so if we want to find the interest on, here's the principal, here's the rate, we're going to change that to 0 0.03 because you move the decimal two places, and then here is the time. So we're going to write $17,000, that means times, 0 0.03, in this case 4 means multiply, 8 years, and then you're going to type all of that into your calculator. So $17,000 times 0 point, sorry, my calculator was doing something weird, times 8. So the interest, let me see if I did that. I want to make sure I did that. All right, $17,000, because my calculator was doing something weird. Okay, $4,080. Now we have to find the ending balance. Well, the ending balance is you're starting with principal and you're adding the interest. So we're going to take our principal, $17,000. We're going to add the interest, $4,080. dollars and when we're done, we have the ending balance. 7 plus 4 is 11. Carry the 1. So our ending balance is $21,080. And every single time when it's an interest rate, change that to a decimal. But it's the exact same formula each time on simple interest ones. All right, that's it for this one.